still looking at the stars, and he says they help prove the existence of a creator. When Dr. Hugh Ross was a young boy, he was fascinated with astronomy. Hugh read every physics book in the school library by the time he was seven. As a teen, he was convinced the Big Bang Theory was the only explanation for the origin of life, until he picked up the Bible. Since then, Dr. Ross has been providing scientific evidence of a purpose-filled universe and explains recent discoveries in his updated book, The Creator and the Cosmos. Well, join us for more as Dr. Hugh Ross. We welcome him back to the 700 Club. Hugh, it's good to see you. Thank you. I read this book of yours. It is encyclopedic in your knowledge of everything. <laughs> but let me ask you something. How big is this universe? Well, it's about 50 billion trillion stars. Well, those stars what? make up a quarter of a percent of the universe. 50 billion trillion stars. Give 50. or take a few billion. <laughs> 50 billion trillion, and that makes a quarter of the universe? A quarter of a percent. Quarter of a percent. What's the rest of it? Dark matter? The rest of it's dark matter and dark energy. Unbelievable. Yeah. Well, now, you know, where are we? How big is this Earth in compared? I mean, the, the planet we're on compared to that? Well, it's a tiny speck. I mean, our planet's only 8,000 miles in diameter. And the universe is, you know, billions of light years you know, across. Your book basically said that God, the creator,